Let me know when you're ready. Okay, it's six seven. Application against chain of custody form, because as you know in the audit directive, you cannot use a precinct if the chain of custody forms are incomplete. That's correct. We found that there were three precincts that were incomplete. Euclid 8B, Lakewood 4F, and Parma 7E. Okay. Two were missing signatures. One was completely missing, the form is. Okay. Um, so we pulled those out. We reselected. Uh, we added four precincts to make up for those three. Okay. Still ended up with 54 total precincts. Okay. It was our total. The first time I mentioned it was at 53, it ended up with 54. Our new number is 11,844 total ballots we're going to count. Okay. Um, in addition to those 54 precincts, we added the four precincts that we knew about power down shutdown issues on election day. Good. And those are going to be added, so we'll do a total of 58. Can you tell me which precincts the power down issues were? Off the top of my head, you're going to make it 4C, Cleveland 17A, Seven Hills 2A. Let's go take a look at the end. They're on the end here. Okay. Now while we're walking, when we started and I said okay, I didn't have the record button on, I just had the camera on. <laughs> Do you remember the number of ballots? You'll tell me. 11,844 is how many we're going to count. Okay. The 5% threshold is 11,730. When we picked our 5%, it ended up being 11,844. Okay. Here's your four power down. Okay. So Great. Four is the height 6A was the one I couldn't remember. Okay. Great. So these are all the ones we randomly selected in the audit up to here. We're going to count those first. Okay. And then we're going to, in addition to that, add these four known power down freeze issues. Okay. Known power down freeze issues. And in that case, was a new machine taken out? Do you know? I, I don't have those exact. I don't know. In every instance. The policy was to take a new stick out there. The same machine was used because every I'm machine. I'm going to grab this sticker. Every machine was uh, apt, susceptible to the power down freeze issue. So we just took a new stick out there, had them rescan all the ballots to make sure we didn't miss any ballot while that machine was touched. They figured out what the issue was with it. Okay. But they may have replaced the machines out there. I just don't have that information at my fingertips. Okay. The cool. policy was not to change it unless there was a machine issue other than the power down freeze issue. Okay. And, and you thought that the stick would take care of that? Well, we got him a new stick because we didn't know if a ballot was hanging there, if for whatever reason it didn't get counted. We want to make sure all the ballots were counted, so we had them do is take a new stick out there, you put the new stick in the machine, and then you start at zero. See, they took all the ballots out of the bottom, and a DNR rescanned every ballot to make sure that every ballot, okay. and if they got any message on the screen, they had to send it down here in a voter intent envelope. And the, okay, and... Okay, what did they send down in a voter intent? The ballot. So if they get if they get accept reject, that comes back down here with the board of. Got it. So any well, accept reject. Yes. Okay. Um, and but the but replacing the stick on, let's say if it were the same machine, the machine did not refreeze and power down. As far as I know, no. Okay. They didn't have any other instances of that the rest of the day. Okay, so that's interesting. So it would seem to have something to do with possibly the stick. Yeah? Possibly. No. It's in it's inside the machine. It's just it's pure random chance. That's comforting. Well, they're working on it. They don't have a solution yet. <laughs> they're working on it. <laughs> they're working on it. That's, that's twenty four seven they told us. That's what I got from them. So Okay. So, so thus far we've counted this many three things. I wish I had an exact number for you. These have all been counted? These have all been counted and they all match the official count exactly. Okay, and we add one more? We add one more. The one I've got on the table over there, right now we have a discrepancy in it. But the one with the green sheet at the top? If, yeah, that's our trouble table over there. Okay. Um, we have had other ones that had to go to the trouble table. So far, every time it's been that, it's because when they're sorting the page ones and the page twos, issue one floats. Okay. Democratic page ones, it may be on the back of the front page, it may be on the... Okay. And they just missed one when they sort. Okay. Okay. So that's what we've discovered. So but far. everything has like come here, out a okay. Yes, like here, they initially counted 112, but it turns out when they did, when well, no, we recounted their stacks of 10, they had a miscount in one of their piles. So they did 10, 10. One of them had nine. Okay. So I had to add it to it. So it took their number down one. Okay. And then if you add in the three remakes to it, the total should have been 114. So 111 plus three equals 114, which is what we had in unity for the official counts. Okay. That one just happened to be right in front of me. Here's another one that we looked at. So we have 
Bell was misordered in page two, so it went from 55 to 56 is what we expected, so. Okay.